Hey everyone, we are in October, and as soon as I let this mic down a little bit here, just trying to fix it so it sounds better for you guys. We are in October right now, and we're going to go over a couple of stats for the month of Nutley, and what I think is going to happen in the next couple of months when it comes to... Um, the fourth quarter of 2024 in real estate. I haven't done an update in a little while on this channel because I've been busy working on my other channels I have out there as well. But I'm going to give you an update and talk about living in Nutley. And if you are thinking about moving to Nutley and if you are thinking about selling your home in Nutley. And I'm going to try and answer all the questions that I can for you to see if that is the right decision. So... Let's talk about the overall market in Nutley, New Jersey right now. We are looking at more inventory year over year. So what that means is we have more inventory on the market right now than we did last year at this time. And there are reasons for that. Even though the interest rate is better than it was, if my memory serves me correctly, interest rates are better than what they were last year. They are better this year for buyers. We have inventory on the market. It's about maybe a month and maybe almost two months worth of inventory right now. Uh, a healthy market, like a normal middle of the road market, which is fair to buyers and sellers, is around five to six months worth of inventory. Right now, we have about 1.8 to be exact, 1.8 months worth of inventory. So it's still a slanter, uh, still, it's still a sellers type of market right now in town now that doesn't mean that sellers can come in and expect 10 20 30 offers like we saw in the past you know so since COVID 2020 2021 2022 2023 we are four years removed from the COVID market so we're starting to go and trend back towards a more normal market right now we're, we're going towards a more normal market but that being said when a home is priced accordingly when a home is marketed properly you can expect a multiple offer situation maybe two three maybe four offers not 10 20 30 offers like i used to see you know two years ago okay Home prices in Nutley have steadily been rising still. We have more million-dollar homes. The last several homes I have sold have been over a million or at a million, 1.1, 1.3. My new listing at 518 Prospect Street, which we're doing an open house tomorrow. Shameless plug. We're doing an open house tomorrow from 12 to 3 p.m. That home is listed at 1.1 million. Now, I get comments all the time about people saying, oh my God, who would spend a million dollars to live in Nutley? Well, a lot of people would, depending on what the home is like. The new buyers today don't mind spending upwards of a million dollars, but they want amenities. They want a nice big house. They want a home that is pristine, clean, and neat. And that's what they're looking at. That's what they want. Uh, so, yes, million-dollar homes are starting to become more common in Nutley. And I like to stay to say that my office started that trend uh, because of the marketing that we do to reach out to buyers that are a little more affluent and want those type of homes. The average tax bill on a million-dollar home in Nutley is about twenty grand at minimum if you're looking at that type of property. And a lot of them are found up in the Nutley Park section where we have the larger homes like on Highfield Lane, on Satterwaith, on Nutley Ave, on Rutgers. You know, that whole area there, Nutley Park, is where we're fetching a million dollars for those homes. Um, the average price of a home in Nutley is about 600000 right now. So for you buyers that are coming into town... You're going to spend at least $600,000 for a home. And that's kind of where it's at right now. And, you know, the rates do influence purchase decisions. And right now we're looking at, you know, average price is $600,000. The average rate right now is about 6.5%. You can talk to a mortgage person. I have them in-house if you need them. But the average is 6.5%. 
So, that being said, is it a good time to sell? Is it a good time to buy? Well, the projected values in Nutley Homes for 2025 is a rise of 5%. So, if you're buying this time next year, you're going to pay 5% more. How are rates going to be? Nobody knows right now. We are in the middle of a crazy election year, and I think... I think a lot of people are kind of just holding their ground right now and kind of thinking, you know, hey, what's going to happen after the election? Are things going to change? Are more people going to sell? Are more people going to buy? Are rates going to go down? The forecasting interest rate cuts. I think you're going to see at the beginning of the year, you're most likely going to see interest rate cuts. That's what I think we're going to see. All depends upon that inflation number. Now, we did get a little reduction like several weeks ago, but it came right back up. So now we're at 6.5%. But homes are going to become more expensive next year. Aside from any black swan event, I don't see that changing for the next year at least. Aside from anything else, if something geopolitical happens, another COVID type event, I don't see things much changing next year. You know, maybe the rates will come down a little bit. Home prices are going to go higher. You know, I always say, you know, if you have a need to buy, you buy. If you have a need to sell, you sell. And that's kind of where we're at right now. And if you have any questions about living in Nutley or buying or selling a home in Nutley, you can always reach out to me. I'm Matt Defeaty with Realty Executives Elite Homes. Have a great day.